In today's video, we're going to be talking about another top 5 modded skins that I think you should go ahead and check out in Smash Ultimate. The amount of work and dedication that have gone into these skins is just, it's phenomenal, it's great. And if you guys are new to the channel, hi, hello, welcome, my name is Mango, I play a lot of Smash Bros. Um, but yeah, go ahead, feel free to subscribe, and I hope you guys happen to enjoy the video. Thank you. So starting it off with number 5, I'm actually going to go for the Squall skin. Uh, that's over Chrom, and I think this is actually a pretty clean one. I'll kind of show you guys in detail as to what it looks like and some of the little details that I do enjoy about it. So, can we stand together? Can, can you be civilized? Alright. <clears throat> cool. So, take, taking a look at both these boys. Um, we have uh, Squall looking clean as hell, dog. Like, look at some of the straps on his actual arm and... Uh, the buckles that are on his belt like that is super super good um, and something that I was actually mentioning earlier that I actually really did enjoy that they did was they actually used his uh, Keyblade Finra instead of his actual like his gun blade from his original game like he hit the Leonhard crest on his shoulder is actually super cool too um, And even the details down to like the hair and shit like that, too Yeah, like it would have been cool to see some other characters in Sm and, and smash that represent the Final Fantasy series like again someone like um someone like knock this i feel like would make a good choice and like with the introduction of sephiroth i feel like it would be cool if we also got more like final fantasy villains oh dude i love that chrome has so many like juggle options with up to up air oh man that victory screen is super clean too and then we can kind of see the details a little further up close but again like i said super clean even down to the necklace the necklace of the, uh, the lean heart symbol is pretty cool too for the next skin that I do want to talk about, it's probably like a personal favorite to me, uh, more or less. Um, <laughs> and if you guys are a fan of the anime, I feel like you guys would also happen to love this skin as well. Um, but that's actually going to be uh, Ava Unit 1 Terry. Evangelion happens to be one of my favorite animes, so as soon as I seen this shit, I was like, I have to hop on immediately. Oh, and paired up with the Akechi skin from Marth. So something that I was thinking um, when I was making this was that, like, well, it would definitely make sense if, like, someone made this, like, a... Uh like a skin for like Dark Samus or something, right? Um, and then I thought a little more about it. Like if you guys are actual fans of the anime itself, then uh, you would know that like uh, like Ava Unit 1, when Shinji's operating it, like he has a gun and shit, but he doesn't really uh, use that as his main tactic of like fighting. Ava Unit 1 is kind of just like a brawler more or less. The fact that again, I, I do appreciate that Terry is played as his skin. Um, because it does kind of fit more of Ava Units 1's, like, uh, fight style more or less. And, oh, man, look at the, look at the detail on the actual helmet itself, too. Um, but let's get a closer look and see, uh, some of the details that are actually on this skin itself. The colors and the shapes that are actually used for this model is, like, really, really clean. Um, I think these are one of the skins that, like, someone might have made on their own 100%. You can't make that up, folks. You can't make that up. Yo, man, playing so many of these Terry skins is honestly gonna, like, make me, like, end up playing Terry for fun. No! Dang, guys, I wanted to end it with the Buster Wolf, but... Uh, again, yo, the helmet looks clean, colors look clean, uh, and the model itself just, it's well put together. 10 out of 10 overall. Now, the next model is a model that I'm actually, like, crazy, crazy. Like, as soon as I seen this model, I was like... I have to hop on this immediately. You guys might have seen it at the beginning of the video. Spoiler alert. For number three on my list here, um, I couldn't help it, but we gotta put my boy Tanjiro. Excuse me? Um, and again, like looking at like some of the like tinier things, like let's check out some of his taunts. Just to kind of show the skin off a little more. Nice. Uh, the fact that they use the uh, they use Roy for uh, Tanjiro skin, I don't want to spoil it too much. Is I think it was honestly like a pretty sick option. Um, all right, let's take a look at the Roy skin and see what's good. All right, <laughs> I was saying this a couple times, but the actual like uh, the fact that like Tanjiro is like almost breaking his neck, this always kills me. Looking at this, some of the detail in the gi itself, and oh, look at the, the like the sleeves. The sleeves go into crazy detail, and his katana too. It's like it's kind of, it's, ah. uh, his katana is like ripped straight out of the anime. Uh, there's actually a Demon Slayer game that's coming out that was made by CyberConnect, the same people who made the Naruto Storm games. 
guys are definitely fans of Demon Slayer, I would definitely uh, give it a YouTube search for sure. Oh, look at the little tiny air details, like the, the actual like earrings themselves. Uh, the hair, the hair itself is like, wow. <laughs> Let's go. Nice, nice. Okay, okay. That I can actually deal with. Um, the next skin is actually going to be a skin for my boy Cloud, and that's going to be the uh, Kingdom Hearts One outfit for Cloud. Uh, and Cloud was actually one of the first characters that I picked up once I started playing Ultimate. Ooh, okay. Hold on, hold on. Let's um, let's get these guys out of here. All right. Let's look. Let's look. The hair definitely looks a little brighter, but I guess, yeah, Cloud's hair was uh, a little brighter in Kingdom Hearts 1, but look at the bandages on the blade, man. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, and the hill. Oh, and he has his little claw arm thing. Hold on, hold on. Chill, the detail on this skin, man. Is this the, the model from D Dissidia? And the wing, too? The wing is clean, man. And the cape? Dude, like, and the rips at the bottom of the cape too. Like, you you can't get any better than that, man. Wow, that is that's that's amazing. That's really really good. All right, cool. Yo, fighting Cloud in Kingdom Hearts One was like one of the most exhilarating things in my life. Yeah, so like, I never really got to see how bad um, Smash Four uh, Cloud was, just because like one, I didn't have a Wii U, and two, like, I just didn't really care too much about um, about Smash at the time. Like, it was just a game that I was just like, all right, cool, like. I play it for the time being, but that's really like about it. Or if I'm like at a friend's house or some shit like that, you know. Oh, the finishing touch. I can't complain, dude. Like this is clean. This is super nice. Like, shout out to, again. Shout out to the guy who made this. Ten out of ten. A skin that I recommend. The skin that I do want to show you guys for number one on this list. It's going to be the Sora skin for shulk i don't play shulk but i'll i'll definitely play shulk if it involves me playing sora oh that's it it's so close come on disney just stop doing it to us this right here is impressive uh can, how far can we zoom in all right oh i can't even go that far because oh wow that actually kind of sucks um but anyway we can see we can see as much detail as we can here um the keyblade is just looking super clean look at that um Yo, the, the hair, the colors, like the actual skin itself, like he looks like he's like literally straight out of Kingdom Hearts 3, which I'm, I'm pretty sure like they found a way to get the model somehow. Oh man, dude, I'm excited for this. Like, I would love to see Sora and Smash. If it don't happen, cool. If it do happen, cool. But this, this gives me as much hope as I, as I think it would. Oh, that's sick. sick oh wait he has his own taunts too hold on that's a sick taunt oh i'm trying to see what the counter looks like sick beep oh let's go Oh man, Sora, 10 out of 10. Like I can't, I have no complaints for this. Nice, nice. All right, this is it for me. Like I am, I am, I'm here for, I'm here for the Sora skin. Like that's it, 100% of me. That's gonna be a wrap for today's video. I hope you guys happen to enjoy. Don't forget, go ahead, like, comment, share with all your friends. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.